down tilt, up tilt into Power Geyser is tearing. We think that's the coolest thing right now, dude. That's, that's so cool. I mean, it, it's already been a couple of weeks, and I'm still popping off every time I see that. It's so cool. And then we're gonna, and, and then uh, we're gonna read, we're gonna watch these vods, and we're gonna like, man, what was I thinking? Once this becomes like a standard <laughs> for the character. As we begin this set, it is gonna be Kles and Muffin from Mars in the second set of Winter Semis. A date with Charlie the King in Winter's Finals on the line. Mm -hmm. Oh, fair, not gonna connect, but Muffin getting a lot of damage here. Oh, nice patience coming in from both players. But now we got down tilted uh, jabs. Man, that kind of kind of unfortunate stuff coming in from class. Like he's getting a lot of these uh, these di like these di hopefuls for the burning knuckle, but he's just a little off every time. But it's good stuff coming in from Muffin for DIing out on everything. Yeah, excellent work not to panic a moment ago after missing that tech because you saw Muffin does like to go for some of these <laughs> he hard He just reads, went for it. He just went for that Buster Wolf. He just did it. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, nice forward tilt. Uh, kind of catching Kles for not greeting the egg for greeting out of the ledge. Yeah, no harm, no foul. It is going to be. 0% apiece for the moment until Kles is just going to take the first 40%. Mm -hmm. Oh, forward throw. Oh, I couldn't get that that landing up there. Yeah, this time the mistech comes out from Muffin, but again, he does not go for the hasty roll forward. Mm -hmm. Muffin getting him with that fair, now spacing him away. That's kind of the name of this game is like, Muffin can fight him, but he doesn't really need to. He, he also has one hell of a tool against um, Terry's recovery, and that's Down Smash. Down Smash is so good. Right. Like, it's a three-hitter. It's, it's super active, and... Oh, and that's also... Uh, that's a Muffin special, like, using that up B as a way to gimp people as well. And especially since Rising Tackle doesn't directly snap the ledge at all distances, mm -hmm. you can just go for that Down Smash with a bit more impunity. Mm -hmm. But, uh, and, and another good, like, uh, option is that forward tilt, because that's also two frames. Right. Yep. And yeah, hitting him with the up B, making him reco recover a bit higher than he needed to, and then punishing him for it. There you saw it. Lucas just has so many different ways to two frame you, whether it's down smash or that PK freeze or the F tilt, which we just saw. Yep, or down tilt, or down smash, or forward tilt. He's got too much. Man, not down air if you're feeling particularly spicy, oh, which wow. Muffin was right there with a PK fire. It's going to be a two stock for the first game of the mm -hmm. semis. Yeah. Uh, uh, Kles was not feeling a bit comfortable on that, on that matchup. And it's going to be a hard one because, like, Lucas is kind of a mid range ca like character. Yeah, without a doubt. It's not as if. Terry needs to be as close as, say, Ken does, but he yeah. does prefer to get things started with one of his tilts rather than his specials. Yeah. Like, he definitely wants to, like, wait you out, hit you with the tilt, and then uh, get the confirm. He has a he has a few really good, like, get-in options with the, with his specials, but, like, they're all, like, they're only available as reads. Like, if you do them, they're very unsafe. Right. We already saw him often get a you punishes on those a couple of times when mm. Plus wanted to go for them, especially in the second stock. Oh, these Nair's coming in from Kles and liking how he gets uh, Muffin in the corner, but now he's off stage, and this is a really pro big problem. Nice. Got that maximum um, distance on his recovery. Yeah, Kles escaping that. That could have been a lot more dangerous than it turned out to be. Oh, crack shoot. In my opinion, probably one of the best anti airs in the game. Oh, I like the rising tackle, but it didn't kill. There's a bear. Good stuff coming in from class. One stock taken, but Muffin not relenting at all. Nice, nice get up attack to deal with the down smash or triple hit. Oh, you can air dodge away from that. After you get hit by um, what do you call it? The down tilt. Oh, actually, the air dodge killed him. <laughs> I think if he did just the side B and then the up B, he might have been able to live. I think the air dodge was intended to just avoid the PK freeze, but yeah. it just ended up having the unnecessary side effect of killing himself. In the yeah. Process. Ooh, but nice stuck on the corner. 
perfect shield, but not able to get anything out of it. Yeah, kind of unfortunate. Roll. Dash attack to get him back into the corner. But Muffin's been using all of his tools to, like, get himself out of it. And, and that that dub, that DJ cancels there is so good as, like, the uh, kind of get out of uh, the corner. F hey, get out of the corner free option. Yeah, yeah, words are hard. Muffin is very practiced with this Zare train, actually. It has to be frame perfect to work if you want to go across the stage. But I've seen him get it on multiple occasions in bracket. Mm. Yeah, he's, he's, he's very well versed with the character. And there's the down tilt Buster Wolf. Just immediate, too. Yeah, what opportunistic timing from Plus. He was at 100% exactly. Oh, but now he's dead. <laughs> got hit, uh, got thrown with the back throw, and it was just immediate. There's an air coming in. Ooh. Down throw into up air. Zare coming in from uh, Muffin to get himself give himself some room. Goes on the other side though and crosses him up with that double jab to power dunk. Mm -hmm. The bread and butter coming in from uh, Kles. Four throw just get himself some stage control. Nice. Nair in double Nair into uh, Burning Knuckle. Yeah, Kles feeling himself now. Mm -hmm. Has to find some way back into neutral, but he still has the percent lead for now. Oh, two down tilts, Bernie Knuckle. He has to be a bit wary of that because you can... Uh, oh, nice. Power dunk, that'll be it. Yeah, we saw him fishing for down tilt a couple times on that final stock, but when he finally got it, and especially uh, towards the ledge of the stage, there was just nowhere to go but the blast zone for Muffin. Yeah, but when he does throw out that second... That second down tilt, you can air dodge right. through him. Because you have seen Muffin do it before. But it's kind of like more of a reset thing. And like it's it's pretty hard to get out of it. But now... We've got this game number three. It is going to be the same characters as well as the same venue. Mm -hmm. Muffin and Kles tied at a game of peace. Yep. Now we're waiting him out. Game number three. Oh, just getting uh, another bread and butter, 34%. Another jab one, two power dunk. Is he going to? No, he's going to go for the burning knuckle this time. Mm hmm There. Not going to connect. Waiting him out. Nice double jump count. Uh, nice uh, Zare, but now he's getting grabbed. Nothing true out of that down throw. Not at this percent anyway. Mm -hmm. Like after zero percent, like the, the, none of nothing works actually. I think some. I think someone on Twitter calculated the percent window as like three percent or something, like practically useless like that. Yeah. Oh, nice recovery. As if any one of Terry's moves does less than three. That is true. He does not really have he, he, a pummel. <laughs> Maybe. You, you can pummel and that's it. <laughs> oh, actually that Buster Wolf was so good, it got him out of the corner. And that was quick thinking as well because the PK Thunder 2 was what actually put him over the 100% threshold. He had to formulate that plan on the fly. Yeah. Oh, getting him a gut up attack. And there's a crack shoot. Oh, ambitious uh, rising tackle. Oh, uh, another ambitious dash attack, too. Oh, but there's the back throw that's going to catch him and it's going to kill him. Ooh. Plus, he's going to be the first to lose a stock, and Muffin looking to capitalize on his momentum. Another perfect shield, Dude, but... these parries are coming... are pretty crazy coming in from both players. Muffin's going to capitalize on one of his own shields to get up attack, too, and able to get another fair out of it. Nice crack shoot, but there's a bear, and that's death. Yeah, it looks like Muffin wanted to go for the PK Thunder 2 mix-up, but before he could even connect, Kles scouted it out and finally went for that quick area. Yeah, that crack shoot got him, like, in the perfect position to hit him with the bear after. But he still only has 92%, and Muffin is running away with his lead. Oh, there's the up bear into bear into another up bear, <laughs> nearly taking out the stock. A forward tilt into dash attack, and that's death. I was all ready to scream if he got that kill, but... Gonna have to settle for probably the less ceremonious kill there. Mm -hmm. Oh, down throw again. I'm trying to get a reset, man. Down tilt to jabs. 
PK fire. Missing on that double ticket. That DJ cancel is there. Yeah, tag roll outward, the play for Plus. Does get the double jab to power dunk, but still a percentage heap to make up. Oh, right into the that game. might Freeze be death. Well. Oh, no. Recovers high. Good stuff coming in from Plus, but he still needs to take out the stock because he is way behind. And uh, him not being able to snap the ledge is going to be a bit of a problem. That was an ambitious power dunk. Not going to Not going to kill. Plus is over the 100% threshold in triple digits, so we'll have both of those oh. super specials available. Oh, nice parry. He's just fishing for some of these down tilts as well. Mm. Yeah, he's been he's been not uh Quest hasn't been as confident as as he's been before in the last in the last set even. And that's gonna be another game for Muffin as well. A two stock at that. Mm-hmm. <laughs> just, we saw the energy sort of draining from him. He was just going for some of these safer options, unwilling to take a risk, and Muffin just made him pay for it. Yeah. Because, uh, definitely had, like, after that, those down tilts, he could, I'm pretty sure he could lead it into, like, an up tilt. I mean, we saw him fail to punish down smash on more than one occasion, but we are going to see the character switch to Cloud now. Yeah. Three, two, yeah, he does want this one. win, so he's going to, he's going to opt for his, uh, Original main. Well, he's like, uh, he's mainly a co-main with both of those characters. With Ken, and, I mean, with uh, Ryu, I mean, Ken and uh, Cloud. But he is a uh, climb hazard. Climb hazard master. He does not let you hit his shield. <laughs> yeah, Terry gonna have to be put on pause for the moment. Ooh. And it's a, a much different matchup. Oh, it hit his shield once again, getting punished by the climb hazard. <laughs> nice stuff coming in from uh, Muffin, though. And as much more of a threat as he might be within just specific neutral interactions from Plus's perspective. Oh, he got him with the last hit, but he didn't die. What a play as well. Muffin did well to not get hit by every hit of the... I cannot even speak right now. What is he yeah. going for? No, dude, he keeps going for these climb hazards. <laughs> like... <laughs> like Cloud probably has one of the best out of shield options with that climb hazard, and Kles abuses it. Like, absolutely abuses it. No, he's not gonna go. Oh, he didn't snap the ledge. Got forward smashed immediately. And uh, uh, Muffin now has the lead. Yeah, that limit boosted up special, putting him straight into trouble. Dash attack, not gonna kill. Nice parry, not gonna do anything out of it though. Oh, he DJ canceled way too early. Back air underneath the platform, gonna take that first stock from Muffin. Wanted to get another cross slash going, but Muffin gonna interrupt that. Yeah, actually beating him out entirely. His up beat, oh, did it again. Don't tell me he's gonna do another one. Oh, nice parry coming in from Muffin. Oh, wow, that, he couldn't punish the climb hazard with the up smash. Kinda unfortunate for Muffin. Does have limit. Oh. Parries coming in from Muffin. And not only parries, two parries at a crucial time with Limit on deck to just stall some oh, that's timer death. out. Oh, wait, hold on. Did it get rid of the actual projectile itself? No, it hit him, but he didn't get hit by the, like, he only got hit by, like, the second hit, and he fell out of the third, fourth, and the fifth. <laughs> oh, my, I think you're right, actually. Yeah. What happened there? Yeah. It was just, it was just mad and unfortunate, and he just, he just fell. <laughs> he fell too low for the PK Thunder to even hit himself. Oh, but now, um, Plus in a pretty pretty good spot. Muffin needs to close out the stock, but he, um, Lucas's kill options are pretty easy, pretty good. You can't really do, you can't really punish that with up smash. Yeah, that time he's gonna land on top of the platform. I think Muffin was anticipating landing on the same level, so he would have been able to get the first hit of up smash rather than relying on the second or third. Yeah. These parries from both players. Ooh. Oh, went for the, went for the blade beam. Stuck. There's the down, uh, the dare, but there's the grab. Not gonna kill. Oh, going for the climb hazard. Real scary there. He's gonna get hit with a blade beam as well. Misses the tech on top of the platform. <laughs> He's just spamming up. 
<laughs> he traded and he did it again. He's looking like every <laughs> Elite Smash Cloud right now, but better. <laughs> oh man, this is more exaggerated. Let's go, Clash. <laughs> man, Muffin, Muffin's having such a hard time because he feels like... Because a lot of Lucas's options on shield are like nearly completely safe. Like his fair on shield is actually positive. And not only that, a lot of his options, Mare in particular... Oh, oh well, man, that is a bear. Not even letting me finish that sentence. Yeah. Plus, going to take that early with the third back air. Yeah, it was uh, pretty clean. Pretty clean coming in from Kles. Yeah, the character switch seemed to work out. Yeah, but now um, I'm pretty sure it's going to be a bit harder for him because uh, he's going... Uh, Muffin has probably adapted a bit better to Kles' playstyle. And not only that, he has the counter pick as well. So going to a stage like PS2, <laughs> he's been—they've been PS2 the entire set. I didn't see. Did he really <laughs> just opt to go? Yeah, they've gone PS2 basically every time. Our, oh, oh no! Oh, he's good. He's losing. He's losing. Oh, but he could have got the dare okay. after. The dare after that would have been scary. <laughs> it's di away after the climb hazard. That's how. Uh, Helps you punish a bit easier. I didn't trap the ledge for a moment a bit early with the down smash too. Man, he just... If you ever notice, Quest does not like characters that snap the ledge. <laughs> That's a good point, actually. <laughs> Man, oh. That Zare just giving uh, Muffin some space. Muffin playing a lot more patient than he was before. He actually got the roll read in, but... Oh, no, he lost his jump. Late. Yeah, that's it. He lost his jump, but oh he's no. dead. He killed himself, yeah. Yeah, that up special not affording him that same distance. He would have made it back with, with the limit on deck, but he just expounded it with that cross slash off stage. <laughs> oh, wait, hold on. <laughs> it, it was like the retreating cross slash, but <laughs> he just fell out of it. Oh, trying to catch him with the anti-air cross slash. Not going to get it, though. Oh, nice fair into dash attack. Muffin having a hard time. Another fair. Yeah, Kles is starting a lot of his approaches either on or underneath the platform. Mm -hmm. Oh, that was very unsafe. He didn't hit him. <laughs> Muffin getting a finally getting a punish. Blade Beam gonna make met with a shield and another up special out of shield. <laughs> oh. Oh my gosh. I mean, if it if there's it works, <laughs> there's no need to change it, right? Yeah. That's still funny. <laughs> Forward throw. Oh, man, Muffin. Oh, there's a landing up there into another one, but can't really fit, uh, can't really follow that up. Limit up that oh, that's really bad. Yeah, he's going to be put into disadvantage. He uses the air dodge oh. to make it back. Yeah. Oh, but here we go. <laughs> he just went for the up B again. I think he did that out of instinct. I don't think he actually wanted to do that one. Maybe not, but whatever the case, Kles is going to get the dash attack to get mm -hmm. Muffin from Mars onto his winner side stock. Yeah. Oh, went for the... Oh, nice read. <laughs> that was a mix-up if I've ever seen it. Yeah, death. Fly. That is definitely death. He did not have his jump. Actually catching his jump with the PK Thunder. So in a decisive game five, we are onto a final stock for both Kles and Muffin. Mm-hmm. Oh, there we go. Oh, no. Couldn't get the punish. Couldn't get that punish either. Nice landing up there. But even after that small combo, the the, the big, strong hits of the Cloud Sword are uh, out DPSing Muffin. A couple of pummels on the Muffin as well Ooh. with the dash attack afterwards, putting him up to 75%. Nice Tomahawk grab coming in from Kles. Muffin's still having a hard time dealing with this disjoint, actually. Another back air underneath the platform. Muffin is so close to death here. PK fire. Nothing. Oh, there we go. Muffin had something going, but he couldn't really follow it up. Limits on deck, so if he can pretty much get anything except for that up special. And Blade Beam. I don't think Blade Beam would kill. Oh, nice. Muffin, this might be it. Oh, no, he didn't get the down smash. PK freeze, not going to connect. Oh, Muffin on the offensive. Nice recovery coming in from Kles. Blade Beam to push him away. Oh, nice landing there. Very, very risky. 
things coming in from both players. So you have to respect that fair on the shield. Oh, nice parry. Nice parry. Forward throw? No, you went for the back throw. Just going to regain stage control. Does not oh. bring the normal get up. Nice parry yet again. Oh, another parry. We've just seen oh, five <laughs> parries in the last, like, ten seconds. Wow, that didn't connect. And there's a forward tilt. He's dead. Good stuff coming from Muffin. He was in such a... He was so behind for a long time, and then he brought it back. Yeah, dug himself quite the hole, but by the thinnest of margins, mm -hmm. Muffin for Mars is going to get into winner's finals. Plus, still a very valiant effort in the loser's run. If he keeps playing like the way he did in game four, we could be seeing him back in loser's finals again. Mm -hmm.